flooding, temporary, but all the same flooding. Same is true for Western Scotland, with the same reason, the ground is quite saturated. And the incoming air could well cause some greyness on the heights in Aberdeenshire, the higher ground. Otherwise, it's a mild morning with some sunshine, particularly in Western England. And we come down here, this morning mist and murk sort of lifted into low cloud. You might have temporarily grey cloud above your head, otherwise a fine looking day. But the southeasterly breeze will bring in more cloud from lifted fog in Belgium or France for the southeast corner. The rain is edging slowly in, but because it's slow moving, it's persistent still in Northern Ireland and Scotland. Mild or even warm again everywhere. Now on Friday evening and Friday night, that, this is a combination of three fronts, moves across. Out of Northern Ireland, across a good part of Britain, to start Saturday like that. It takes all of Saturday to leave South East England, East Anglia, behind it a few big showers. Pretty warm weather all the same, but a little fresher. But Saturday's a good looking day. Of course, it's October the 31st, it's Halloween. It will be a fine evening. You didn't want to know that, did you? However, if you stay out till midnight, it's a completely different story. Mild it may well be, and then all of a sudden, you know what the blue means, that is rain. That's introduced us to November. Rain and gales. Not everywhere will the gales be, and probably not everywhere will the rain be, but it's a pretty big developing low. It's explosive in its nature. The rain will spread across most of the UK, if not all, and for a time, some will have very strong winds. And that will also usher in rather lower temperatures. So we're back down to average.